Hi, this is Tracy from Gift Basket Appeal, and today we're going to take these wine bottles and upcycle them into a table centerpiece or a fireplace decoration. So let's get started. This wonderful event is hosted by the channel G's Creations, and the hashtag Fall in Love with Autumn is what we're using. So if you need to find our videos, there's lots of other crafters included in this collaboration. Just check in the description box below. You're going to need a wine bottle and I will be using a matte acrylic paint and it's nutmeg brown and that's what I'm going to use to paint my wine bottle. And I'm just going to start by putting on the first coat. I want this to get a lot of coverage. So I'm using one of these sponge brushes because I like the smoothness of it as the paint goes on. I chose the color brown, but I could also use some other colors to do this as well, like orange. And when I think of fall, I also think of yellows, reds, kind of like earth tones. So this is going on pretty smoothly. I like how the acrylic paint goes on the glass. Of course, you won't be able to display these outside. These are just for indoor display. It's a nice way to add something to your mantle. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and let this dry. I went ahead and put on another coat. I let it dry between coats for about 20 to 30 minutes. And so right now it looks very smooth. You can't see through it and it's great. Now I have to decide what I want to decorate it with. So what I decided was to make these little really tiny gold leaves. And so I'm going to actually hot glue them onto the bottle to give it that fall effect. So there's a bunch of them here and all I did was I just cut these out myself. They were really easy. They're kind of stiff on this cardboard, kind of a, somewhat of a, a stiff backing. And so all I did was took my metallic marker and I just wanted to give it a little bit more character. right around the edge of it. I'm just making a little outline so it'll stand out a little more and then I'm putting a line through the middle just like a leaf. Just to give it a little bit more character. And those are going to look nice because they're real sparkly. I'll just go ahead and do another one. And these were so easy to, I just cut them out freehand. Okay, and do another one. And it's that simple. So we got a bunch of these. I'm just going to hold them up so you can see them a little bit more. And they're real sparkly. So now I'm going to hot glue these onto our, our bottle.
And I wasn't sure how I wanted to position them. But I think I'm just gonna go all the way around and have them like this. I'm going to do that all the way around. And you can do them however you want. You can randomly place them all over the bottle as well. But this is a great upcycle project. So get all of those wine bottles and some paint and have fun. I may not need all of these leaves, but I could always use them for something else. There's so much you can do with these wine bottles. And also, uh, check out Pinterest. Um, there's just so much wine bottle art projects. And I will put the link below to my Pinterest page. I think I have one called Wine Bottle Art. And I plan on doing more of these projects as the year progresses. Now that all the leaves are hot glued on there, all I'm doing now is taking my metallic pen I'm just outlining it, just to give it a little bit more character. Let me hold that up so you can see. Just around the edges. And just take your time. You gotta have a little bit of a steady hand for this. And you could basically add as much or as little as you want to. I just did a little bit with the pen right around the edge there. You could stick a flower in the top and you're good to go. So we're all done with that. I could stick a cute little flower in the top. And I'll come back and show you some of the other projects that I created. So now our project is all done. Let me just get you to take a closer look. Sorry about the lighting. And our leaves are all on there. I'm gonna show you some other ones that I made that I got a little bit more creative with. Here's another one. I painted it orange. Took a burlap brown ribbon and wrapped it around. And then I put some sequins on the ribbon. All right, and a final one, which actually is my favorite, is when I put a flower on it and it's just perfect. I really like this one. Let me know which one is your favorite also in the comments below. But I had a necklace that broke and I love the beads. So I kept saving the beads and I used them on here. I just hot glued them onto the burlap ribbon. And I thought this flower was just really nice. I had it tucked away somewhere. So everything I used is stuff that I already had in the house. So really, I'm just amazed by how many things you can find in your house to be creative with. So that's the end of our video. Please like, share, don't forget to subscribe. And also, if you wanna see the other creators that are doing crafts for the autumn, fall season, just look in the description box below and you'll see all of the links. I hope you enjoyed this video and be creative.